Welcome back to part two of Tyler and I's trip to Italy. If you're subscribed to my main beauty channel, you'll have seen a lot of these first clips, but this is the extended version where I include our Barbie core bachelorette brunch, shopping in Positano, our rehearsal dinner before the wedding, plus all the souvenirs I picked up along the way and a boat day in Capri. Hope you enjoy this week in my life in Italy. Hey, it's Jackie and welcome back to my channel for my wedding day video. I am currently getting ready, people are setting up like all around me so I'm up against this pretty stone wall in the villa that I'm staying at and I thought I would bring you along. I've had the best time traveling with Tyler, we were just in Rome. I had so much fun picking out really cute outfits and vlogging that whole thing on my second channel and now we're in Sorrento and um... Yeah, I'll show you behind the scenes, getting ready, all the details, stay tuned. Here we are arriving in Sorrento from Naples and it's like stepping into a postcard. Sorrento is one of the most picturesque places I've ever seen. Tyler and I chose an Airbnb perched high off the cliffs, offering an absolutely breathtaking view of the entire coast. This is where we stayed for the week and also celebrated our wedding. Just look at the view, Sorrento with the towering Mount Vesuvius. Before I dive into the makeup details, let me give you a little tour of this charming villa. When I described my dream location to Tyler, I envisioned a place with blue and white tiles, dark wood accents, stone walls, and of course, a pool. This villa perfectly captured the homey Italian vibe I was dreaming of. wedding stuff that needs to be dealt with. Here, our oversized luggage. And another bathroom. As you can see, I'm all smiles as we headed into downtown Sorrento for a lively family dinner. Take a photo there. Weather. Big wine. Hey, <laughs> And the next day, let's jump into my whimsical wedding makeup. On my beauty channel, Jackie Wires, I have a full talk through makeup tutorial of this get ready with me, but for this extended vlog, we just have a quick little time lapse. Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks. I always wanted to wear a Charlotte Tilbury lipstick on my wedding day. This one is Nude Romance. Yeah, this shade's gorgeous. It's quite different from the trial that I posted. I just think this is a little bit more romantic. I went with like princess core for trying on dresses. This one, yeah, a little bit more romantic. All-time favorite dry shampoo is the Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Dry Shampoo. Massage. Get some volume in. I know wedding day is like you're supposed to get pampered and stuff, but I don't like people touching me. I literally do everything myself. Like I do my nails. These are just Olive and June press-ons, which are my all-time favorite. I do my own makeup, my own hair, <laughs> but I like it that way. It's like a calming little ritual. Okay, I will see you when I got my curls done. Time for hair. I'm using my favorite curling iron that makes an appearance in every video. It's broken, but I love it. We're crying. 
crafting a little veil piece. We're doing some DIY flowers. Help. Yeah, I think it'll just like twinkle in the light. I think it'll be pretty. Okay. Hey, Dad. <laughs> okay, I just DIY'd these little flowers that have some sparkles for the veil. added a bunch of my favorite pop culture moments into this look. So we have the Mamma Mia flowers, a little bit Christine Day in the hair, and then this makeup was kind of Margot Robbie and Taylor Hill inspired. I'll put my inspo photos, but I can't wait for you to see this entire look. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look. Okay, let's try this on. I'll do the other one. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love green like this and this matches my bridesmaids. These were in my size, I thrifted them. I'll put the site down below. Oh, oh they fit perfect. How gorgeous, these are my dream shoes. So I've already done this look before. I filmed it for TikTok and Instagram and me and Tyler did our own private photo shoot, our own first look because I really wanted to do golden hour. It's just not a lot of time to work with and I wanted to be really relaxed on my wedding day knowing I got great bridal photos and then I could just take fun ones with my bridesmaids. So I hired Shivani who is amazing. I've already seen some of the photos she took. It's a great one. <laughs> into the next location. Got a lot of help, mom and dad. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Everybody team. Everybody get the video. Oh. Hi, where's your body? She's hiding. <laughs> we are packed in. Yesterday, it was one of the best days of me and Tyler's life. It was so beautiful. And now, if you can see, I have this Barbie core outfit on. Barbie core is very 2023, but you know what? I had so many Barbie core things that when I decided to do a bachelorette just with the girls that are here, I thought, well, let's bring all the decor I have back. And I went with this Barbie core style. I made it a little bit more Bridget Bardot, but I will show you the whole setup. It's so cute. Welcome back to Barbie core summer. I finally got the Fun Boy and Barbie collab. I love their floaties and this towel. Put out some Olive and June nails for the girls that they sent over, and these are my absolute favorite nails. I wore them for my wedding. Hey, bye, Ken. <laughs> Oh, yeah. This is the crafting station. Hey, Lauren. Hi. And I've always wanted to do this DIY. I saved it so many times, so I picked up everybody a phone case. We had snacks while attempting to make this beachy barbie core phone case. I'm recording you. How did you do this? <laughs> I really liked how Regan's turned out because she kept it a lot more simple, but do any of us use these cases? None of us. So do I recommend this DIY? Not necessarily. Jackie, explain. So 
we're finding rings that have been hidden all around. Did you find mine? I did. So Jackie has picked specific words that we're not allowed to say, and if we say them, we get to steal the rings from each other, and at the end of the day, whoever has the most rings. It's a prize. Yeah. Lauren, how many do you have so far? Uh, oh my gosh. A lot. Lauren's <laughs> loaded. Oh wow. Uh, wow, I have, Eight? I have four. <laughs> I got five. Reagan, I'm coming to you. A lot. You have a ton. Oh. <laughs> And the phrase that I chose is I feel like because I realized we all start all of our sentences with that Whoever has the most rings at the end of today and we get a little prize. So I'm excited. This looks so beautiful Baby take it to go in the Barbie <laughs> Oh my god I wish we had a bit more time to hang out by the pool, but we did have a driver come pick us up to head to Positano, and while we were on our way, the guys went to Pompeii. It's famously known for its well-preserved ruins, an ancient city that was buried under volcanic ash after the catastrophic eruption of Mount Vesuvius. We did very different day trips. The shopping in Positano is so cute. very expensive. We went to the viral CB Positano store and I would say this one was like one of the most reasonable along the strip. I like these dresses. I have no regrets with the purchases that I bought because I've been using the bag like crazy. It is so comfortable and I love the kind of cottagecore vibe. There are so many little streets to explore but we kept on the main strip and I was looking for a couple gifts. Since we had so much Italian food, we stopped for sushi and it was amazing here. Did some damage. Then we headed over to Tyler's family's villa to meet up with everyone and they put on the sweetest rehearsal dinner for us. The sun was setting and Tyler's parents are amazing cooks. They made everyone incredible food from scratch. This was like the best meal that we had on our entire trip and the food in Italy is amazing. You're so tall you can't even see beers on the ground. <laughs> It's the next day and I'm doing my bridal look all over again for the actual wedding dinner that has a fairy tale aesthetic. Oh my gosh, people are getting here. I just saw a bunch of flowers walk by. It's so pretty. Hey, Yippee. <laughs> the table and chairs, a bunch of flowers. So for this time around, I don't want to wear a big veil just because it's like a little bit harder to move around. And I like how you can see my hair. So I made all these flowers again that I initially put on my veil. Um, and I made a couple extra ones for my bridesmaids. Oh, wait, look at these details. I guess I should get out of my PJs. <laughs> these are from Free People. You've already seen my dress and clips by now, but uh, I'll show you my little party dress coming up. I go from tying your shoes when you're little to tying your wedding dress. Yeah. <laughs> Two person job. <laughs> Here's the rental. Look at her look. Oh. You. <laughs> we got her in green. I told the story about you getting your makeup done because you're so pretty. Ooh. 
little DIY I think action. there's two here. Yeah. Oh, babe. Yeah. Yay. Oh, that looks so pretty. That looks great, guys. Awesome. Jackie looks Thank tonight. You. Okay, too. Thanks. Thanks. I always looked up to Tyler, wanted to, to be like Tyler, wanted to, to follow in his footsteps. Yeah, I love you very much. I need it to look sweet. Okay. Here journaling in the sunrise. Do you see the rain? Oh my gosh. <laughs> gonna get the rain. Oh, this is such a drama yesterday. <gasps> Do you have it? Right. Woo! Putting together everybody's thank you cards. These are from Fable England. I love the nautical feel. So I just wrote a little postcard on the back. She put on a hell of a wedding. Now she's relaxing back. Shivani got me pistachio tiramisu to try. Oh my gosh. She said this is her favorite. It's freaking delicious. Mm. Also, this beautiful dress is from Disney Style. And at the bottom it says once upon a time to keep the fairy tale vibes alive with this stunning dress that was gifted from camila and disney it looks like versace it has the most beautiful details so thank you to disney style for sending this over we then spent more time downtown in sorrento and oh my gosh it's one of my favorite places ever the shops and restaurants are all outside so colorful many lemons Love Sorrento, so we're staying in Hotel Nice. This is another outfit of the day. I love it. I'm Serena Vanderwoodson. So I just got the prettiest music box and it kind of looks like my wedding dress, like the mini one I wore. So I'm very excited. It was from that store right there. And I think I got the perfect souvenirs. Yay! <laughs> Called. Um, Quattro Fromaggi. 
think it's the second one on the first list. It's a Harry Potter theme. What? Okay, now say it. Bogni Giovanni. <laughs> That's where we're headed. We're going to a really cool pool, and maybe we'll do Capri today, but we'll see how we feel. But I'm wearing this really cute lemon bikini, and we're just gonna lay out, jump in the water. It looks really beautiful. Buses come by. I was so happy on this boat ride, it was beyond beautiful, and I love being around water. Run, Jackie, run! 
It was bittersweet to leave, but we decided to go to Belgium where we first met for the rest of our honeymoon. So that'll be in the next vlog as well as going to Paris. We made it to Belgium. Woo, we got all of our stuff. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know that half of it was the same as the video that I put on my main channel, but I thought it would be fun as kind of a keepsake to just have the entire week as a cohesive vlog and story to look back at. So thank you for watching, and especially if you watch the second time. If you want to check out my website, I have articles covering travel, beauty, diary posts, and more. It's at JackieWires.Beauty, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye!